excited about that. <laughs> you didn't know that we were flying either. No, I had no idea. <laughs> I thought we were driving to like a little resort in Texas. Resort or bed and breakfast in like Boston. That's yeah. where I thought we were going. And then we pulled into the airport. But I kind of wanted to just drive around and then be like, <laughs> just Which kidding. Which would have been hilarious. It wouldn't have been hilarious. It would have been kind of yeah, disappointing. It would, been, it would have been so cold that I would have been proud of you. <laughs> Sedona, Arizona. I know I look a lot different than the last time <laughs> you saw me on camera because I've spent the entire day looking like I rolled out of bed. I don't know, whatever it is about airplanes that make you look just lifeless, it's the worst. Now I finally look like I have some life in me. I did my makeup. I'm going to fix my hair. I don't have anywhere higher to set this camera unless I like, there, you're stacked on top of a cup. <laughs> Even that's not big enough. Anyways, um, we are here with 30 minutes to get dressed um, for dinner because I have reservations at 6.30 for a resort on, or a restaurant on the resort. Um, this resort is called Enchantment Resort, so I will let you guys know the 411. <laughs> Do people still say that, 411? Um, I'll let you know the info once we leave here on how it was but so far so good everyone has been extremely friendly and it is an absolutely beautiful area just the drive here because we had to drive two hours from the airport to get here was just stunning like it's a two hour drive that you want to make because it was just beautiful um so the two hour drive from the airport was not a big deal because of just everything we got to see and you know talk on the way and it was really nice so we'll see how dinner goes um yeah i just kind of want to sit outside like and just look around and it is hot as heck here in arizona but i was told it's like record breaking heat this weekend we came on like the hottest weekend so i didn't really think that through but it's jeff's birthday so it was gonna have to be this weekend um but that's not a big deal because I plan on being by the pool all day tomorrow and at the spa, so totally fine. <laughs> Jeff was super surprised. I don't think in his wildest dreams he would have picked or thought of Sedona, Arizona, but I just wanted to go somewhere different, you know? Like it seems random, but a lot of people, when I asked on Instagram, said that Sedona was like one of the most romantic places they had been. So, you know, I just, Picked it on a whim and here we are. I like the spontaneity of it all and I hope that Jeff has a super happy birthday. All right, so I'm gonna turn off the camera and get back on in a second so I can finish getting dressed because I think our reservation is in like five minutes. So we are on our way to dinner. I think the restaurant is called Shay Achi or something like that. I don't know, very Indian I yeah, suppose. Yeah, it's all Indian, yep. Which I think is super cool. 
You guys should see the view from here. It's really pretty. And I'm gonna be out of breath because this guy, this guy's getting heavy. But let me turn the camera around and show you. It's so beautiful. The camera doesn't even do it justice. I feel like it's way closer to us than it is showing in the camera. But it's beautiful. Kinda looks like it wants to rain. <laughs> One of the things that made me want to go here was the pool like overlooked that and it looked really cool. You look handsome in your new shirt I got you. <laughs> Thank you, that's a nice shirt. This is French toast. That is strawberry rhubarb. Mm -hmm. So like a strawberry jam I guess. I yeah, it's a compote. And then there's duck somewhere on here. That's right here. Thank <laughs> God. Oh my goodness. I guess it's like chicken and waffles, I suppose. I got a tenderloin. We got some asparagus. What did you get? New York strip. Okay. And then we also got some mashed potatoes that are on their way. Pretty as simple. Well. Yeah, but it looks really good. It smells good anyways. This bee is to keeps attacking me. Yeah, apparently it's a meat eating bee. That's what she would say. What? That it's that's terrifying. She's saying it's attracted to the meat and not the sweets. Ugh, that's disgusting. <laughs> Hi, honey. Hi. You look beautiful. Thank you. We're in like the... We're in the old people pool yeah. because the other pool, like the family pool, is full. Yeah. I, they have like, you can... They have a max capacity of like 50 people, but they can only put out so many chairs, they said, so. Yep. There was no chairs left, but we have reservations at the spa pool in just a little bit. So. Yeah. I mean, we have to pay for it, which sucks, but at least we're going to be by the yeah, pool. But. but it still feels good to not be out here, like, worried about the kids, chasing the kids, you know. Yeah, I mean, you're letting I your mom never, do that. Yeah. Never get to do that, so. I know. This is nice. And I have a mocktail. Mm-hmm. I don't know what it is, but soda, lime, some kind of spice, and... It's a lemonade. It's fancy. Yeah, but it's kind of fizzy, so I guess... I don't know. Ginger ale. Now that I'm looking back, I can see all the signs I tried to feel Okay, you're gonna have to do one of each so that I can get a better idea. <laughs> okay, you ready? Mm hmm. Hold on, let me zoom out so I can get the full effect. Okay, I like those. Those look good. Mm, those also look good. Mm hmm. Yeah, one more time. Like, just look casual. Just look cash. <laughs> Alright, other one. Let's go with the brown boots tonight. <laughs> so we're on our way to dinner. We spent most of the day at the pool, so we didn't vlog a whole lot today because um, the pool that we were at was the spa pool and it was really quiet. And it would have been totally awkward if I would have pulled my camera out and talked this loud because it really was so quiet, which was so nice. <laughs> there was like no splashing except for like one random guy. It was an adults only pool, so it was really enjoyable and couldn't really vlog. I did um, show you guys like the scenery that we were looking at. It just looks unreal. Like when you're laying there looking up, it just looks like a, a picture. It doesn't even look real. So um, we are going to go to dinner. We're going to go to Javelina Cantina, I think is what it's called. I had asked so many people on Instagram for recommendations and I got tons. So first of all, a lot of people must live uh, in Arizona that follow me there on Instagram. Uh, more than I thought really because I had gotten so many recommendations and I wish that we had time to eat at all of them We are going back tomorrow afternoon Unfortunately because we have 
lives and kids and everything to get back to. So this has been a great getaway so far, but um, Javelina Cantina is obviously uh, Mexican food and I love me some good Mexican food. I really wish that I could have a margarita. So Jeff will have to have one for me tonight unless they've got like a mock margarita or something because this guy. But yeah, anyways, we're going to head that way because we're about 30 minutes away. <laughs> Cheers with my Diet Coke. <laughs> Good morning. It is Sunday. I look a little tired. I feel like I'm still trying to wake up. We are two hours ahead in Texas, so we wake up early because like our body clocks wake up early, so we've been waking up at like 7 because um, it's actually 9 o'clock at home, so anyways. I don't know why that has anything to do with me being tired, but I think it's just allergies here. Ever since we've been here, I've been like sneezing and um, like my nose has been stopped up and stuff. And I know that it's allergies uh, because yesterday I took an allergy pill and I was like golden. And this morning again, it's just like my nose is stuffy and it's whatever trees they have here in Arizona because there's a lot of them and whatever they are. Um, must be allergic to them. Anyways, we are headed out today. Um, we are going home. Our flight is at 4.15, which will put us home at a little after 8, Texas time. And we are excited to get home and see our babies, but it's kind of bittersweet for this to come to an end. Um, it always goes by so fast. Two nights is, is just not nearly enough, but it's better than nothing and I'm super thankful that we were able to come out here and do this for a little weekend getaway but this is our back porch scenery it seems like every every place here in Arizona looks like this it's all like adobe colored which I think is really cool um, but anyways we're gonna go have some lunch or brunch I should say because we haven't eaten breakfast and possibly check out Cathedral Rock before we head to the airport. Um, we are actually two hours away from the airport, so we have to allow for two hours to drive to the airport, but the the drive is absolutely beautiful, as you guys saw some of that footage, and I'm obsessed with those cute little cactuses. There, I've never in my life, like in Texas, we have the ugly little circle cactuses that are on the ground everywhere that they have here also, but when you're driving here, you see the big, tall cactuses. Like, I don't know, that was a highlight. For me on our drive here brought little crew with me um i mean he's always with me but i love this name ring and i just thought it would be cool to show you guys here um his little name with the mountain view in the background Thank you. 